Hola, welcome to my channel. My name is Risa and this is Divine Portal. So today my beautiful, powerful, magical Leos, I'm going to be pulling some messages for you all as well as some love messages from your person, whoever you've been connecting with, whoever you've been thinking of. Okay, we're going to see how that person feels about you, what they want to tell you, and what they've been thinking of you. So let's just jump right into it. Before I tap into your person's energy, I'm just going to take a look at the general energy that's surrounding you right now. We're going to see what messages need to come out. Okay. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. On this channel, I only use cards that I have handmade myself that I've created okay so if you like the messages if they resonate with you please subscribe please like the video please leave me a comment the more that you all interact with me under these videos the more that I'll do readings for your signs okay the reason the reason that I don't do many Leo videos is because um, I don't get that many views on the videos so I just feel like maybe you guys don't like them so if you do like them please let me know guys okay <clears throat> I'm here to cater to you so let me know okay <clears throat> angels ancestors spirit guides forces from the other side please pass along the most important most loving, accurate messages for all of the beautiful Leos out there, the ones who are watching this video right now, and those that will watch this video in the future. Thank you, Spirit. The most loving, accurate messages for Leos. What messages do we need for Leos? Ooh, beautiful. Okay, we have generous. Okay, someone could be very generous. Maybe this is your energy. Maybe you've been very generous with people. Um, or you could be connecting to a person that is going to be very generous with you. Maybe they're going to want to spoil you. Okay, um, they're going to be very giving. Beautiful, or like I said, this could be your energy. And please place these messages how they fit into your story, okay? And then we have on this side protected from hateful magic, okay? So, Leo, if you've been feeling like someone has been, you know, sending negative vibes, negative energy, hateful, jealous energy your way, just know that you're protected from that, okay? Your angels, your ancestors. God, goddess, whoever you pray to, be, um, they are protecting you, okay? You have this invisible, magical shield around you, and anytime anyone sends, you know, the negative vibes, the evil eye, whatever, it just bounces off of you, and it returns to that person, okay? Beautiful energy. Beautiful energy, Leo. What else do we have for Leo? We have disloyal and cheating, okay? So you could have been connecting to a person that was disloyal, that was cheating on you. There was a person in the situation that was a cheater that was disloyal, okay? Ooh, this, someone could be in jail, okay? Maybe you might hear of somebody going to jail. Maybe you know somebody that's already in jail. What do we have for Leo? Ooh, and somebody is longing for you. They miss you. They want to talk to you. They want to see you. They want to connect with you. So if you found out, Leo, that somebody was cheating on you or they were being disloyal, um, I feel like this person, maybe you disconnected from this person maybe you're no longer speaking the way that they would like and now they miss you now they want to talk to you
What do we have for Leo? What do we have for Leo? Ooh. So on this side, we have homie happening. <laughs> okay. So somebody could have been connecting to um, maybe their friend, a friend here, or maybe someone... Um, Maybe, okay, someone connected with a person and then maybe they realized that they liked the friend more than the person that they were originally connecting with. Um, maybe, maybe somebody's friend likes you. Maybe, um, yeah, you know what this means, right? Okay. And then on this side, we have cat fight. Okay, so there could be um, two females fighting over a masculine, right? Maybe one of, the, I don't know, maybe maybe one of the female's friends likes their masculine or, I don't know, there's just like drama energy here, okay? Someone's homie hopping and it's causing cat fights, okay? Ooh. And again, we have generous on this side, okay? Maybe somebody's friend treats this person better. I don't know. Let me get, let me shuffle it one more time and then we'll see. Ooh, and then we have generational blessings. So maybe someone was supposed to end up with a friend. I don't know. Either way, you're going to be receiving blessings, okay? Maybe your ancestors are going to be very generous with you. Maybe they've been um, bringing certain connections your way or certain opportunities or blessings. What do we have for Leo? Beautiful energy. Beautiful. What do we have for Leo? Ooh, what do we have for our beautiful Leos? We have a lesson learned. Okay, maybe you've learned your lesson. Maybe someone around you has learned their lesson. If you've learned all your lessons or, you know, you're learning from your mistakes, I feel like your ancestors, your angels, God, God is whoever, like I said, whoever you pray to, I feel like they've seen you grow. They see that you're learning Okay, and that's why they are blessing you. I'm hearing you're like elevating. Leo. We have pure and genuine. This could be you, Leo. Maybe people feel like your energy is just very pure very genuine you could be connecting to someone that's gonna be genuine and pure with you Leo 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 we have caught up someone here got caught up this could be you this could be your person I'm hearing the song by Usher. Okay, you know which one. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, and then we have projecting. Okay, so somebody here might have gotten caught cheating or caught, you know, talking to other people. Maybe you found out about it. Maybe they started projecting onto you, accusing you of doing certain things. You know what I mean? Let me do it one more time. Let's see what else do we have for Leo. Leo energy. Leo. 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 What do we have for Leo? What do we have for Leo? I 
and this one says let them go so if you have been holding on to a person that you know you need to release leo it's time to let this person go okay <clears throat> so i feel like you know who i'm talking about leo whoever this person that's been holding on to you maybe there's been lots of drama with this person lots of fights like lots of arguing um yeah spirit is telling you to let go okay they're gonna guide you down the right path just have faith okay whenever you do finally release a certain situation a certain connection a certain person the universe is going to reward you they're gonna bless you okay Let's see what we got here for you. Ooh. Okay. So we have you will be rewarded. Like I said, if you've been learning your lessons, if you've been releasing things that no longer resonate with you, that no longer fit into your life, you know, it's time for you to release them and i'm not saying release them with you know with negativity and with hate release it with love and know that whatever comes after is going to be beautiful it's going to be abundant you're going to receive generational blessings you're gonna if you haven't already okay maybe you are being rewarded now maybe and it's crazy because you've been receiving um, and getting a lot of beautiful cards, beautiful energy, generous energy, right? We saw the generous card. We saw the generational blessings, rewards, okay? Just beautiful, abundant energy for you, Leo. And we have new start, okay? Maybe you are a little afraid or apprehensive about starting new or... Um, you know, maybe you've been comfortable with the, the life that you've been living or the people that have been in your life. Maybe it's been comfortable, right? But I feel like it's time to start new, go on a new journey, okay? I feel like it's going to be very rewarding, very abundant, very, very blissful, just beautiful, okay? We have air. You could be connecting with an air sign. We have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Okay. Um, you could have air in your chart. Maybe your person has air in their chart. And then we have court legal matters. So some of you, okay, those of you that are dealing with court situations, legal situations, I feel like you will be rewarded, okay? It's going to go in your favor, okay? Whatever you've been dealing with, whatever you've been um going through if you know that your heart is pure and your intentions are pure just know that everything is going to go in your favor okay oh and then we have revengeful okay so look how court is under this card right and look how revenge is under this one okay so someone there could be someone from your past that is mad about you starting new, okay? They could be trying to seek revenge. I feel like someone doesn't want to see you abundant. They don't want to see you start new, okay? This could be anyone from your past. It could be a past lover, a friend, a family member. I don't know. Just someone, okay? I feel like you know who this is. This person's holding on to you. And then we have Heartbreaker. So... Um, this could be someone that broke your heart. <sighs> Maybe you've gotten your heart broken in the past, Leo. Maybe this is why you're kind of apprehensive on starting new. Let me see. Let me pull two more from the top. Ooh. Okay, I got four. This one says exposed. Someone might have been exposed, okay? Someone might threaten to expose you. Maybe someone's revengeful. They want to expose you. They want to, um, I don't know, okay? We have fake friend. There could be a friend around you that's fake, okay? I'm hearing they smiling your face, right? 
but they talk shit behind your back, okay? But, like, you know who this is. This friend could also be revengeful. Ooh. Okay, so we saw the homie hopping, right? Okay, so, Leo, I feel like maybe... I'm hearing maybe one of your friends person likes you more. And maybe this is why your friend is mad because there's someone that likes you more than than your friend. If there is a situation with friends, I feel like the you're the friend that they like, okay? You're the friend that they would choose. And this is why this friend is mad possibly. I don't know. If this resonates, please let me know, you guys. Okay. We have original, so you could be connecting to someone that's very original. Maybe someone feels like you're original. Um, could be this air sign, right? Maybe this air sign is known to break hearts. Um, maybe you feel like this air sign is going to break your heart. I don't know. And then we have Virgo. You could be connecting with the Virgo. Um, something could have happened during Virgo season. Mm, they could have it in their chart. Maybe you have it in yours. Hmm. Ooh, okay, so there could be a Virgo that's threatening to expose you. They could be trying to take you to court. But just know that you're going to be rewarded. I don't know. That's for somebody out there. Okay. Whew. That's a lot. I feel like there's a lot of drama going on around you. I don't even feel like you're in the drama. I feel like it's just drama surrounding you, you know? You're just caught in the crossfires or whatever they say. <laughs> okay. Now, now, Leo, take a moment to... Take a moment to think of your person, whoever you've been connecting with, the person that... The person that you clicked on this video to find out about, visualize them. Let's see how this person feels about you, what they want to tell you. How do they feel about their Leo? What do they want to tell their Leo? How do they feel about their Leo? Ooh, this one. So we have older man. You could have an older man in your life. You could be connecting to an older man. And then this one says, I'm so fucking jealous of him. So there's a masculine energy here that other men are jealous of. I don't know why I'm getting the homie hopping story, right? So someone could be connecting to a masculine, right? And maybe they like their friend more. And this other masculine's jealous. I don't know. If you're the if you're the Leo masculine, I feel like there's another man that's jealous of you because their woman likes you. If you're feminine and you're connecting to a masculine, there's another person, possibly an ex, that's jealous of this new man that you're talking to. I don't know. Take it, take it how it resonates. Okay. It's been a minute since I've done a Leo reading, so I'm trying to, like, ease back into your energy. So, let's see. What do we have for Leo? Ooh, didn't I say? There's two men here, okay? There's two men involved. I feel like one of the men is favored over the other one, okay? Someone here might be interested in having a threesome with two men. I don't know. Just throwing that out there. Whew. Okay, what do we have for Leo? Let's see. I'm being called to pull this one. Oh, we have bitter ex. So you could have an ex that's bitter. Okay. We have catfish. Okay. Um, someone here could be eating fish. Maybe they love maybe they love catfish or like seafood. Maybe someone wants to go out to eat for seafood. Maybe someone here smells like fish. Maybe someone here is a catfish. I don't know. We have family obligation. Someone here is obligated to their family. 
what okay let's see what what can you tell me for for leo there's this x if you're feminine okay you're connecting to a masculine i feel like their ex is really bitter maybe their ex isn't as pretty as you maybe their ex doesn't really take care of their hygiene as well as you do um if you're masculine leo i feel like you have this ex that's bitter at the fact that you're moving on We have afraid to tell you the truth. Maybe someone here is afraid to open up and express what's been going on. We have, I can't get enough of you. This person can't get enough of you. What do we, okay. What do we have for Leo? What do we have for Leo? Leo, Leo. Someone here might already have a family. We have, hey stranger. So this could be someone from your past. This could be someone that wants to come through and, you know, maybe come out of nowhere and and start talking to you again. We have, you're my weakness and my strength. So you make this person weak, but you also give them strength. We have handsome man, top tier. So the masculine energy here is very handsome top tier I feel like if you're a, a feminine Leo or a masculine Leo I feel like you're so fine okay people fall in love with you on accident and it causes like drama <laughs> and you're just like I'm just here okay it's not my fault <laughs> this one says I'm no longer unsure so if someone was like wishy-washy in the beginning, they didn't know what they wanted, I feel like now they know for sure that they want you, okay? Even if this person already has a family or already has children, I feel like they know that they want you, Leo, okay? This one says, you make me feel safe, okay? This person feels safe around you. They feel safe in your energy. Maybe this is why someone's so attracted to you. Maybe you're wondering, why does this person keep you know, coming back to me, why does this person, why does this person like me? I feel like it's because not only are you handsome or you're beautiful, but you make this person feel safe, okay? We have older woman, MILF, cougar, so if you are a feminine energy and you have children, I feel like this person loves that about you. Um, there's an older woman here, okay, that's a MILF, she's a cougar. I'm hearing she has money. She's, you know, independent. Okay. This one says your body is so sexy. So someone loves your body. There's a masculine energy here that's so sexy. Their body's sexy. There's a feminine energy here that's sexy as well. Hmm. This one says, stop bothering me. So you could feel like you're bothering someone. Or this person might, I feel like there's someone that wants to reach out to you, but they feel like they bother you or they don't want to be a bother or they don't want to like start drama. You know, I'm getting this feeling like there's someone that's really attracted to, to you, Leo. Okay, whether you're a feminine or masculine someone's really attracted to you maybe they feel bad that they like you because it could start drama but it's like they can't help it you know but they i don't know it's like something about you that keeps drawing them to you leo this one says i have so much fun with you this person loves to hang out with you they love to spend time with you we have a a plant that's growing so this person could see themselves growing with you they might want to start a family with you let me get two more for leo we have baby on the way didn't i tell you someone here wants to have a baby with you some of you could already be pregnant to my divine feminines maybe you're expecting a baby um to my divine masculines maybe someone here would love to have your baby 
I feel like they feel like your babies would be so beautiful. Leo. Wow. Again, I'm so fucking jealous of him. So there's a masculine energy that's really just making these other men very jealous, okay? <laughs> we have surrender on the bottom. This person wants to surrender to you. I feel like you could be connecting to someone that is very good looking themselves, okay? They might have love options as well, but there's something about you, Leo, okay? They'll surrender to you. They'll submit to you. And I feel like this is why other men are so jealous. If you're a divine feminine, I feel like this masculine will only surrender to you. I don't know. And then we have cuddled up. Okay, someone here wants to be cuddled up with you. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, we have side bitch, secret woman, and then we have it's so wet. Okay, someone here gets really wet. Could be a woman that's a secret. There could be a connection that's a secret, or I don't know. Okay, there's just too much going on here, Leo. Whew, there's just a lot going on here. There's an ex, there's a new person, there's a side bitch, there's this masculine that's causing drama because he's so fine. There's there's other homies that are mad. There's just a lot, Leo. I don't know if this even made sense. Please let me know, guys. Please comment down below. I'm going to post some charms for you. We're going to see what signs are coming towards you, what signs. Um, yeah, okay. I have these charms on my Etsy shop. Okay, I have every sign in here at least twice. So let's see. What signs are coming towards my Leos? That's a lot. Okay, you can have a lot of signs that want you. We have Pisces. Leo, here you are. You could be connecting with a, another Leo. Capricorn. Taurus. Aquarius. Another Aquarius. Taurus. Ah! Hold up. It almost fell. Um, Pisces. Pisces again. I think I just have a lot of Pisces in my bag. I don't know. Aquarius again. Three Aquarius. Three Pisces. Another Leo. We have... Um, Aries, sorry, my mind went blank, and two Scorpios, okay, of course, it could be any sign that you're dealing with right now, but these are just the signs that are the most prominent in your energy, okay, so Leo, if this reading was helpful in any way, please like it, please subscribe if you're new, um, what else, and yeah, thank you so much for for taking a moment to watch this video. I appreciate your time, your energy. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. I love you. Bye.